Hello and greetings, my fellow Long Darkens, and welcome back to our Long Dark Winter Mute Let's Play. Now, I was just thinking rather than bidding, bring the fish back here or not. We do have a two uh, two slot stove here. Uh, I think it's only one slot in the. So we might bring those fish back real quick. Uh, otherwise, I could just actually pick them up and just flop them in there to Jeremiah. But I, I don't know. I feel like cooking would probably be a better idea. Plus, I would like to get. I need to get some water as well. We're not out, but we're running a little low. Let's set up. Otherwise, we're doing quite all right. Uh, last episode, uh, finished up a couple caches. Kind of really debating if I want to go back to the Force Talkers one. I had previously gotten the achievement for that anyway. Uh, I think I just really need the Mystery Lake ones. I know there's a couple little side things we still have to do, I believe. And I'm terribly worried because we're going to have to play through this in the Redux anyway. So, I think the Redux will be a little bit more enjoyable. Uh, all, the vo new f all voice acting as well. That's, that was kind of one of the big uh, pitfalls for me, I thought. It was just a lot of uh, just text and text and text. And yeah, I, I, don't, I don't mind that usually. But in this game, it just seems off-putting. I don't know. Especially if you have to have a lot of the voice in the, uh, there in cinematic parts. Right, no wolves out today. Yeah, that's how we like to see it. I'm about to grab all of this. I'm not going to be able to carry this load for yeah, much we'll longer. We'll be cooking the cook one at a time. I don't think I want to do that. We'll just leave that there. What do you got in here? Oh, scrap metal. Nope. So we're about at 47. Uh, fortunately, not going to be able to run. So how are you guys' days going? Mine's going well. Just, yeah, we're going to be... <laughs> Might as well have time for some small talk. Oh, I was loving my time here in the long dark. And I've seen this in a couple days after this episode probably gets out. Uh, I think that is on a Thursday, the 28th of June. Uh, June, we're gonna get back into our let's play of Interloper. Looking forward to that. Then we'll break to bang out some winter mute, which was nice. Kind of getting back into the our, our let's play of this. I really wish I remembered the story of these pants. I have no idea. Well, there's a flare shell. There was a fire and a dead wolf over there. So I'm going to guess fight gone bad, but we did end up getting him in the end. Good time. Yeah, unfortunately, I cannot. This is as fast. You know, granted, that's a lot of weight. He's not making bad time. Got a little march going there. And up. I'm not gonna. I did actually eat an MRE in the morning just to keep his calories throughout and keep him quiet during today's episode. <laughs> I was like, ah, we'll just keep him quiet today. That'd be nice. Not that I'm saying anything about it, Mark, but yeah, you, you do have a tendency to complain. So we could actually get three. I don't know. I just want to get the one going. I think it would be better than I wouldn't have to... I was thinking about running down, but that's only one anyway. One slot. Nope, not that, Mark. Yeah, there you go. Can we use lamp oil? Yeah. Go for it. Works for me. Normally, if it was far mud, I wouldn't do that, but. Okay, I don't know how long. This might take the entire day. Oh, we got a dream catcher. Nice. Okay, let's get our fish out. Three minutes till ready. Is 
getting too heavy to carry. Okay, we got those two done. I almost ate that. Now let's go to the smaller one first. Starting to weigh me down. Yeah, just one more fish mark, and that should be kind of good because I think we got a blizzard right now, anyway. Um, also, I want to get okay. So, fish wise, do we have? Oh yeah, yeah, we have enough. walk with this much gear. Oh, I thought you had drank. All right. Whoa. Also, let's get another can going. Sadly, I don't think we have any pots out. Maybe in the, the dam, maybe, but yeah. Fortunately, unless we were able to grab the pot. We didn't have pots back when we were in uh, Milton. Sad to say. Okay, you're both on the same time. This gear's starting to slow me down. No, well, I guess we'll... I want to try to hurry. Hit the wrong button there, unfortunately. Part of 40. Sounds like a bit of a blizzard, though. We do have a son of one. I could just be windy, though. Mark your stomach, really? Not just windy. Actually, about 42 kilograms. A lot of it is this fish, though. We'll kind of cut across. Mark, I think you can do it. I think we'll take, not necessarily a shortcut, but we'll just take the more direct path. He's kind of slow right now anyway, but not freezing though. In fact, your hand isn't frozen with that rifle by now. And I thought I almost saw something, but... run. I'll be danged if I'm giving you... Uh, whatever. Do it. <laughs> Just didn't want to have to deal with that. Alright. He picked a convenient time. Especially when I couldn't run. Yeah, but these are Jeremiah's fish, not yours. Maybe a little more leery. We do have the sun on us. And they are a bit more aggressive, as you can see in Winter Mute. Anything that way. We're on the side a little bit. I don't necessarily think either one is a faster way, so we'll just go keep an eye out there. There's usually a wolf kind of around this area, besides the one we just ran into. Sadly, no sad soundtrack music right now. It'd be kind of great for some traveling music, but I think in winter mute it's a little more like when you're 
getting into a part of a story or something scripted rather than just, just traveling along. Kind of right around here. Over top of this hill, we should find Trapper's homestead. Get these fish. Over to Jeremiah. Then we should shoot them and take them back. That's sadly not an option. Yeah, I'll truth be told, if I had a choice between helping Grey Mother and this Jeremiah, probably wouldn't have. They're not likable characters, really, to me. In my opinion, I... Yeah, but... Uh, so far, our player choice in this really hasn't been any. Uh, other than to loot or not loot the Orca gas station, which you can actually just go after that's done, go loot it anyway, so... I kind of felt like that kind of mechanic fell apart. Alright, hit up and over. Oh, there we go. When I go up the hill, thank you. Uh, Max is still hanging out. Good to see. Can't wait to get these fish out of my back. God, the smell. I did some more, more gear at you. I'm being a bit of a pack rat, unfortunately. Get some more firewood as well. Ah, good old trappers. And I will pick up something else just, just because I can't help it. Yeah, so much gear. I don't wonder if we have any moose in Wintermute. I would imagine not. I don't think I have seen. They really kind of suck because they don't think we had the blueprint uh, for crafting one anyway. Maybe something we can learn down the line, though. It'd be a little nicer for the uh, pack rats in story mode. Unfortunately, this wind is also going directly against me, so I'm going even slower than I normally do. Yeah, this is just like going up against an invisible wall. confuse them as they try to track us. This guy was clearly drunk. Right, almost there. I think we just have to put the fish in his little bin outside. And that will count. And we're going to be a whole heck of a lot lighter. be more than enough fish for the job. Oh, there we go. Kind of got out of the, the wind going against us. Now it's going in our direction. Nice. So that should be done now. Yep. He has taught us how to fish, which we kind of already knew how to do. You know why you're talking, Jeremiah? Since you do have infinite fire. Some of the survivor skills, but anyone tackle. Ah, uh, fishing is done. Not much more I can tell you. Okay, so that's done. Uh, harvestable plants. Now let's go. I want to go check other stuff. If 
But I already did that. Uh, okay. Yeah, we already we already did that. I'm just seeing if there's something I hadn't gotten to yet. Yeah, I think nothing really that I haven't. Uh, let's go to our next survival lesson. Well, let's talk about lights. Lights mainly. None of your business. Never mind. It's fine. Uh. How about clothing? Wind or wet will kill you if you let it. Okay, gotcha. Yes. We're back with your damn coat. Ah. Wow, I've been murdering things. All right. You. All this gear is slowing me down. I know about forty. I'm gonna drop some gear. Well, I don't think we can take those fish back. Because right, we gotta carry his bear skin coat. Um, hatchet, that's fine for right now. Just don't think I'm gonna need that. I'm gonna drop that. Just in case. Not really using that right now either. My main thing is I want to be able to run. Can I run now? Yes. Good, good. Feel better now. All right. So they want us to go over to the lookout. You know, not too far. We could actually hit it if we go along this way. Sadly, he won't let us go back to Milton. Which we wouldn't be able to really do. Uh, if we could go through the Forlorn Muskeg way, I think we could get back there. But obviously, Will's got to keep focused. Alright, so let's try to go up this way. And it's kind of a nice day, so I think we could get that done. Though it is... I might have to spend the night out there. We'll go get on the high ground and see if we can see that. Just in case. Yeah, there's the old one. So about this way should be the new one. Yeah, I can see it actually right there. Never been so hungry in my life. Oh, uh, you ate earlier, Mark. Come on, man. As long as we keep in this general direction, we should hit it. Kind of got lost in the tree line a little bit, but I am pretty positive. It's going the right way. I know I've said that before, but let's, don't, don't turn your head, Mark. Don't get distracted. Not sure why I can't go fix this. I have sewing kits. I'm pretty good at sewing. No? All right. I actually broke this quest earlier in development, uh, beginning when it first, when it first came out. Yeah, I, I actually had already gone up there, because I spent so much time, you know, hitting the side stuff, that I had taken the sewing kit that you needed from here. Especially kind of like a story 
Uh, the quest was tied to that specific sewing kit, unfortunately. Well, I was a bit perturbed. Okay, we're... It should be right where all these trees are right now. We're going up the right way. You can see the intact one, I believe. Let's see if we can. Uh, not entirely sure. But this is the general area. Let's see if I can uh, kind of shoot me over. I was kind of surprised you have not sprained an ankle. Sure, that might be the broken one. I think we might have gotten a little off track. I know I said, don't worry, I know where I'm going, but so I can actually see the tower. Oh, whoa, whoa, easy, easy, easy. Oh, come on. Oh, Mark, what are you doing? You goof. You lovable goof. Yeah, I cannot really make it out with all those. I think I got a little bit sidetracked. So I can't go behind the tree either. I think we're generally in the area we need to be, but just cannot make it. Okay, stop trying to kill me. I do a good enough job doing that myself. Also, I don't suppose it hurt to pop all those pills. You can't do much with that hand. Oh come on! You guys saw that, right? That's that's the most ridiculous thing I've ever seen. Also, it's weird they had to pop individual pills for individual parts of the body. I don't think that's how that works. Dang it. Oh no, we're on the right one. Okay. I had thought so, but I was starting to get confused. Then you mark in your delicate, de delicate body. Head over the side. Should be the tr the real trail should be kind of over uh, just across here. I kind of got lost in the tree line for a second. I guess if you ever had that happen, let me know in the comments. Taking a painkiller and immediately two steps later you get another sprain. It just I don't even know. There should be like a mandatory time you shouldn't get another one. Just because I don't know. Well, I hope I can actually get over it. We should be able to. Oh, I don't know now. Oh, no, there I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay, I think we're on the actual trail now. Well, we're close. I think we can shimmy over the side and get onto the actual trail. Might have to go a little bit further down, though. Haha, there we go. 
Nice. Yeah, we'll stop. Have a lightener load as well. I think we've been up here previously. Not 100% sure. I believe they, they fixed that bug with the sewing kit anyway. So I still think it makes you go up here. Alright. Stairs stairs are apparently really, really tough. I don't know what to say. Uh, oh, there we go. I was like, I have no idea what to say. That's not working. Let me get a little bit of a closer picture, too. Still want to get that Canadian flag in there, but... Too bad no wind today, though. Oh, we are officially here, then. Nice. So we need that sewing kit, I believe. We need the bear hide. Oh no, we need the bear hide. That was it, not the sewing kit. Apologies, I forgot about that. Yeah, it's gonna take us about an hour. Yeah, no, no chance of us completely screwing this up. Can I wear it? No. Aww. I guess we'll get something to eat. We'll have that energy bar. Maybe cattail stock. And then we'll turn in. We're about to, we're not probably. But the beauty of uh, winter mute is you can sleep as long as you want. We'll do the normal 10 hours, even though we're not that tired. We'll say who's putzing around or something. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we do have the coat done. Uh, that'll be part two of three of Survival School. We'll see if he has any other relevant quests for us. But yeah, we just have to return to Jer uh, the Mendico to Jeremiah. And then he'll probably make us go harvest some stuff. Yeah, not that time. We actually got a note as well. Map a hidden supply cache. A large text on this note is largely unreadable. The message was meant for someone. Hopefully, they were able to decipher it. Portions there are a handful of recognizable landmarks and a bold arrow pointing to a large X. Okay. I'm kind of worried that's like. I, I know we have that one, but. Oh, for that one up there. Well, we're going back that way anyway. Probably the gentleman I think we'll leave off here. We'll pick up that cash as well. Hope you guys enjoyed. Sure hit that like button up a lot. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.